Hey guys, this is Black Vegeta Sumerite back for another powerful video for my Platinum Crusaders. And today I'm going to be showing you how to make Dio Brando. And pretty much I know he does not look the best Dio, but this is only Dio 1. There is another completely Dio that I'll be making a little bit later. But just wait. <clears throat> so pretty much. I'm gonna be showing you how to make Dio. I will be remaking Dio in like Soul Calibur or in another game because this game doesn't have all the right materials to make Dio. But this is the best I can really do for the first form Dio. But when that second form Dio comes along, trust me, it's gonna be way better. But yeah, guys, let's get right into appearance. Pretty much for height, tallest height, made a middle class for body type, hair type one, eyes type four, pupils type 22. Nose type 3, mouth slash jaw type 7, ears type 3. Skin tone is in the middle and um, you know, third to last column all the way uh, down. Now he is a little bit lighter, just a little bit lighter. So this is the best I can really do. Hair, he has light hair, like a light blonde. Eyes, now some of you may be like, doesn't he have red eyes? Just wait until the second hint. <clears throat> and um, as you can see, I gave him like a dark, dark, dark or orange, pretty much. And uh, yeah, voice. I didn't actually give him a voice yet. I forgot about that. Uh, so let's find him. That's perfect. A little Dio's voice is a little bit lighter, but that's perfect. Even though Dio is a little lighter, that is perfect. <clears throat> so without further ado, let's get right into clothes. Hey guys, it's me again. I'm probably sure some of you are wondering, wait, why are we going to the clothing part? Well, this is a little new feature that I'm adding to the Xenoverse builds of the games. I'm not sure about Soul Calibur or Tekken. Maybe Soul Calibur, but I'm not sure. Maybe games that, you know, really have a lengthy develop processing on making builds like Xenoverse. Uh, I'll do, but pretty much um, I'm going to be showing you how to... Uh, oh, I'm not showing you, but I'm going to be telling you about Dio Brandy and where he originates from. Gonna be doing this a lot because it's a new feature and if you guys like it and request more just leave likes and comments saying that you like it and I'll do more if not I probably just won't do it anymore but without further ado let's jump into the story of Dio Brandy. Dio Brandy originates from an anime slash manga called Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. He plays as the main villain in Phantom Blood and one of the main villain, villains in Stardust Crusaders. Pretty much Dio Brandy is from the slums and he hates his father to the point where he kills his father. He joins the Joestar family because they have a debt to owe with his father, Dio's father, and when he jumps out of the cartridge, cartridge, cart, car, carriage, Pretty much, he ruined a single fam family line. Pretty much, he ruins Jonathan's life and pretty much just makes it miserable. But it, Jonathan has to deal with this for seven years until he realizes that his father is having the same symptoms that Dio's father had when he was about to die. And he realizes that Dio has been trying to kill his father so that he can get heritage to the royal blood, to the family blood. And pretty much he does this and Jonathan stops him. He gets a mask and he uses Jonathan's blood to use the mask to its full potential and becomes a vampire. Dio Brandy is then defeated by Jonathan Joestar. But Jonathan didn't realize to check for everything to be disintegrated and 
right on the same day as Jonathan Joestar gets married, they go upon a ship. Dio reveals that he was alive, only his head was alive, and his body has been completely dis disintegrated. So now he needs Jonathan's body. He plans on to possess. He plans on possessing Jonathan's body. So, as he's about to kill Jonathan, Jonathan then makes the ship explode and tells his wife to grab a baby that's there and go in Dio's coffin because Dio's coffin is pretty much non explodable But Dio had a plan. Dio had a plan. He knew this would probably happen, so he had another coffin aboard the ship and escaped with that. And then after a hundred years, after the events of Battle Tran, Tra I don't know how to pronounce it, but after the events of young Joseph Joestar's journey, Dio reveals that he is alive after a hundred years. And now Jotaro Kujiro, Jotaro Kujiro, I believe that's how you say his last name, aka Jotaro Joestar has, ne has, now, has now to go to Egypt and defeat Dio Brandy. So that's pretty much the story so far that I know of Dio Brandy. He has did one of, he's pretty much like, so far of all the anime I've seen, he's like the worst anime villain I've ever seen. He's that bad, cause I didn't even scratch the surface, like on telling you all the bad stuff he did. I might make a video just explaining all the bad stuff he did. But pretty much that's my outtake about telling you about the, um about Dio Brandy, where he originates from, uh, from in his origin. So pretty much that's it. And uh, yeah, so without further ado, let's truly jump into Clove. <laughs> Praise me, I am Dio Brando. <laughs> ah, and guys, we are back in the clothing department. How did you like that little brief storytelling section that I had. Um, from now on, I'm gonna try to do that with most Xenoverse 2 builds. I'm not sure about Tekken, Soul Calibur, or Jump Force. Gotta see. But yeah, I wonder how you guys like it. But uh, yeah. Without further ado, let's see the equipment that I use. <clears throat> I use Pilot Suit. That was literally the only one I could really find. Um, nothing else really worked, so. That was really the only one I could find. Um, so yeah, for pot, uh, so this was the only one that I could really find. Now I know like the sides do need to be longer, but this is literally the best one I could find. Uh, now there are better pads like that. Like you just need something similar like this or the ones that I'm already using or this. This is good. So um, yeah, that's what I need. But if you don't have any of those, you can just use gloves. I use these because I can get that blue part that he has on the shoes. Um, or use these, or these as well. So, um, yeah, these as well, or these as well. So, you have a lot of options for shoes. Uh, nothing, I know he has a scarf, but we really can't get that on here. Random QQ Bang and a monster. No, I am a devil. And uh, for the part one, for part one deal, that all kind of makes sense. Colors, I use dark brown, dark red. Uh, whitish white, I guess, or grayish white. Um, dark red, dark blue, dark red, brown, dark brown, dark brown, dark blue, dark brown, dark brown, pretty much. That's it for that. For skills, um, spirit stab, like he freezes his opponent in place, time skip, flash skewer, freeze, ice claw. So, yeah, Ice Claw, he really freezes his opponent a lot, so time skip could be like a freeze move, Ice Claw could be a freeze move, Maximum Charge, Sand Spirit as another freeze move, like, couldn't really find that much freeze moves, and Burning Strike, Future Super Saiyan, and Vanish Guard. So yeah, for this build, it's all right. I'm really hyped for part two, Dio, but you know, for this one, it's, uh, it's all right. <coughs> oh man. Thank you for anyone that said God bless you. <clears throat> uh, but uh, yeah, you know, for this one, it's all right. Uh, I'd say I'll give it a nice, you know, 7.5 or maybe 8. Could have been better, but this is all that I could really work with. See you guys.
that will be it. God bless you in the Supreme Studio. Have your Supreme Day. See you later. And peace, my Platinum Crusaders. Mm.